exactly. Yeah, what's going on guys, Table 500 Gaming here, bring your Resonator Hero deck, let's get straight into it. Cool. Right, out of the deck, three Destiny Hero Malicious. Uh, this is your non-tuner level 6 you generally go into, uh, and I'll show you what the tuner level 6 is in a minute. Uh, one Destiny Hero Diamond Dude, um, sometimes good to have a Destiny Hero level 4, you can just search off um, Shadow Mist and Grave. Uh, free Armageddon Knight, probably one of my favourite cards in the deck, uh, it sets up the engine so quickly. Uh, free Shadow Mist, again, gets you where you need to be quite quickly, searches out mass change because Dark War is always good. Uh, two Summon Monk, uh, gets you into rank 4s if you're a bit stuck, it's uh, really the only reason for it, just as another level 4. One Plague Spreader, and the whole reason I even run the deck, free Red Resonator. Uh, this guy is so cool, uh, you summon them, uh, you special summon a level 4 from hand, and instantly synchro for a level 6, uh, generally Coral Dragon. Um, and the one you want to special on this is usually Armageddon Knight or Shadow Mist, uh, and then you want to get your Malicious into play as quickly as possible. Oh, onto the spells. I play two mass change. Uh, I've been playing around a little bit with this. Sometimes I go with three, but I think I'm quite comfortable with two because uh, it's not the main focus of the deck and it is searchable. Uh, one soul charge because you know, getting stuff back from the grave is always good. Uh, one rotor, a lot of warrior targets, easy to search stuff out. Uh, free resonator call, add your red resonator to hand. Makes it so you always end up with it in the open hand, hopefully. Uh, two instant fusions, uh, going into Northern in this deck is uh, really good because you can Northern out a red resonator and uh, go into sixes that way. Uh, triple Destiny draw, um, it's quite easy to go Destiny Hero in hand, uh, so obviously you want to go plus. To break the secrets. Two twin twisters, and the backer removal. Uh, you can afford to discard in this deck, so why not? One foolish burial, put stuff in grave. Uh, one upstart and one allure of darkness. Uh, initially, I added toy around with two allure of darkness, but when it came down to it, I just preferred to have an upstart instead of allure. Free Call the Haunted, again, bringing stuff back from the grave is amazing. Uh, one Solemn and two, two Strikes. Uh, Solemn Brigade, bit of protection, and plus if you make a board, you want to be able to protect that board. And then because I've played every single deck I play lately, it won't rise to full height just for the Omega Loop combo. And you can dump it. Uh, onto the extra deck, this is where Things can either go right or go really, really wrong. Uh, one Coral Dragon, this is the new guy, level 6, tuner. When it goes to the graveyard, you go draw, which means if you make Ultimaya with this, you get a plus one. Uh, Starless Charge Warrior, level 6, gets you a draw when it comes onto the field. Uh, and I play one Omega, just for silly plays you can do with this if you're stuck. Uh, then I play Ultimaya, and followed by Ultimaya I play Michael, Crystal Link, Beals and Void Ogre. Um, all depends on what you want to go into. Sometimes you can make these individually, but generally you want to make Ultimaya and make whatever threat is appropriate. Uh, then we go for some rank 4s, so Castell, Spot Removal, add this Dweller, just so you can sit on this for a while. Although, I don't know why you bother with a board of like a pistol. Beatrice, because you can go into it with all the sixes. And then Dante, because if it gets destroyed. Uh, then you play Northern as the interesting fusion target. And Double Dark Lord, because it's quite easy to make, you know, being a hero deck and all. Um, I'll just do quick. I mean, what you want to go into, mate, really. There you go, where are we? And, uh, so let's say you open <coughs> Red Resonator and a way to access Red Resonator. And then you go on Get Knight as well. So what you do is you go uh, Red Resonator effect, 
special effect. Then you dump uh, malicious, engrave. And what you can do is you can sync these two. For Coral Dragon, banish this, get another copy of it. There's also my. And there's all sorts of little silly combos you can do like that. Um, and also as well, if you somehow are lucky enough to go mass change, you can then banish the other copy of Malicious and set up a Dark World as well as an Ultimate play. And it, it's the board can get out of control a little bit. But um, yeah, we'll see if we can show off some gameplay later on. Okay, thanks for your effort, pal. If you like, if you enjoyed, please like, comment, and subscribe.